We got Chris Gear Spears covering Colorado's forecast for us first this morning. A, a nice day today, Chris, but will those clouds portend some change, huh? Uh, yeah, and those clouds are actually left over from the showers and storms yesterday. Uh, get a few more hours of sunlight and some mixing in here, and I think we'll see those clouds uh, thin out, and you'll get some sunshine, but they will return. I'll show you here in just a minute. Let's start with current temperatures. We are pretty comfortable this morning. In fact, many of our major stations are above freezing, even in the high country. Frisco, one exception. You're 31. We are in the 50s in the Arkansas River Valley, 42 in Akron and Parker this morning, 38 in Durango, 43 in Rifle. Bambi Ma, she's our weather watcher just east of Conifer in the foothills of Jefferson County, 34 degrees. It is 40 out near the airport, southeast of Watkins at Meg Armstrong's house. I want to start with today's future cast. Again, the clouds should thin. You should have mostly sunny skies today. By mid-afternoon, though, uh, we could see just a handful of those little afternoon showers pop up with daytime heating. This does not look to be anything widespread or heavy, but they will be out there. So if you are going to be outside, just keep in mind, you could get a brief shower passing by. I think southern Colorado has the best chance to see one of those today. Now, let's talk about the future. There's a low pressure up here. Uh, near Seattle with a cold front attached to it, and there's a low off the coast of California. As we go through your Sunday, the northern low scoots to our north, but it will drag a cold front through here. The southern low is going to pump in some moisture, and depending on how all this times out, we are talking rain and potentially a late April snow as we roll into your Monday, so we have to watch that for you very closely. Ahead of it tomorrow, as the warm air comes in, we may see some thunderstorms on the eastern plains, and a few of those could be strong just east of Denver. So in typical springtime in the Rockies fashion, we have a pretty dynamic weather system on the way. Highs today, 50s in the high country, 60s down low. A few places may even climb to the 70s out west and in the southeast. On the five-day forecast, so today, not too bad. Tomorrow, warm with afternoon storms. And then we get that chance of snow Monday into Tuesday. Joel, a dramatic drop in temperature. I know a lot of people want to know about snow totals. It's a little too early to discuss that because it will depend on the timing. Is it a daytime uh, snow or a nighttime snow? So stay with us. We'll keep you posted. I'm just, my day's off are Monday and Tuesday, so you, but everybody else will be at work, so there you go. There you go. We're going to tell you about